book and bag truth seeker. Real quick, I want to recommend everyone watch this movie. It's called Get Out. It came out February 24th, 2017. This movie is about mind control. And I didn't know that this is what this movie was going to be about. But this is a real thing that people need to know about. A little more than a year ago, I went into Seattle and I listened to a woman speak who was the victim of MK Ultra. If you don't know what MK Ultra is, look it up. And what she explained was how, as a young child, her own family put her into this MK Ultra program. And essentially, what happened to her is she became a puppet on strings. And she explained how the people who were her controllers, they could just do things with their hands, simple hand gestures that would cause her to act out programmed behaviors. And she had no control over herself when these, you know, controllers were executing the signals. And if that's complicated to understand, just watch this film because this is exactly what this movie's about. And I was watching it with my girlfriend and early in the film, before you even find out it's about mind control, there was an early sign. And I said to my girlfriend, I said, I think this is about mind control and maybe MK Ultra." Well, they never use the phrase MK Ultra, but it becomes very clear that it's about mind control. And there's some scenes in the film where the man who's the controller, he's doing certain things with his hands and he's controlling whole crowds of people at once. So... Check this movie out. This is a release from Hollywood trying to clue people in to the truth about certain things going on in this world. And when we see these false flags, these people who are used as patsies, it's very possible that these people are under MK Ultra mind control, which is something I've talked about for years. But in the time I've been doing this research, I've gotten more information, such as seeing that woman speak last year, and even the release of this film, I think this film is really putting it in front of people's face, you know, about things that are truly happening in this world. So get out, check out this film. Earlier this year before my channel was deleted, I talked about when this film was coming out, I didn't know it was about mind control. Back then they just previewed it as being about racism. I noticed how then it had the gematria of 88, you know, big number with Trump and Trump, very much a racist, which so many people say, how's he a racist? And I just think, well, if you don't know how Trump's a racist, you must be a racist yourself. Donald Trump on the convention said that the lone black guy at one of his rallies who got beat up by a crowd of white people deserved it. I mean, how do you read that if not racist? He began his campaign by saying all Mexicans are doing the raping. <laughs> and then he came out as the pussy grabber. I mean, th there's been a lot of signs that Donald Trump's a racist, a bigot. Absolutely. And, and does he talk about any of the, the issues in this nation in terms of racism and, and oppression? He, he doesn't mention any of it. And, and that's another form of racism. If you're going to be a leader and not talk about things that are real problems for real people who live in this nation, that's a subtle form of racism as well. You know, if you're going to be the leader of the United States of America, you have to take a leadership position on things that matter. And this is a nation that's been programmed to hate. YouTube just took down my video calling out the Zionists. And in that video, I mentioned how the television is constantly making fun of the different races, you know, programming division and hate towards the different races, except for you can never say anything about the Zionist Jews. As soon as I ended that video, it, it, the, I flipped the channel and there was a preview for some sitcom that's on, I think it's called Something About Donuts. Maybe it's on CBS or ABC. But the commercial was, somebody comes in the room and goes, oh, there was just a crime down the street. And then it shows, it goes to a black guy, and the black guy goes, man, I hope it wasn't a black guy. And then there's a Hispanic woman. She goes, I hope it wasn't some Mexican dude. And then there's another guy in the room who's Muslim, and he goes, I hope it wasn't a Muslim. I mean... This is what it is, you guys. This is what programming is. And this is some sitcom written by some Zionist Jew. You know? 
Every day you turn on the TV, nonstop propaganda and put downs for all the usual suspects and constant reinforcement that you can't talk about that one group of people. And this film, Get Out, focuses on the traditional, you know, established white person and the black servant. But it's also very much about mind control, and that's the reason you want to check out this film. All right, until next time.